Behind closed doors, an open dialogue about diversity, safety, and accountability on the SUNY Plattsburgh campus. While our counterparts are, you know, in the library studying, we're out here trying to fight a war against, you know, racism. A racist social media post and how school officials handled it has left many students upset and they're calling for campus-wide change. How can we hold faculty and administration accountable for the things that they are doing? They don't act on urgency when it comes to these racist slurs that pop up on campus. Two representatives from the SUNY system held small group meetings all day Monday. About 100 students attended after what they say has been an emotionally draining week. It's been tense. A lot of us haven't been eating, haven't been sleeping because there's just a lot of work to do. Um, right now I think everyone's pretty exhausted. So I just really hope we can keep the energy up, keep um, fighting for what we know is right. School officials say they too hope to learn something from the conversations. This is an opportunity for the folks from system to hear the concerns of students and help us as we work together to improve the campus uh, together. Students are rallying together saying they want to ensure the entire community understands how deeply the offensive post impacted them. It wasn't just a Snapchat post. It was a demeaning post. It was racist and it just wasn't right. Hopefully we can find a change somewhere. Campus officials warned students that a new social media post, a racist social media post, was shared this morning. They say that police have contacted the poster of that new piece of content. We're told that that person is not a student on campus, but again, students we've talked to say that things are tense here and they don't expect that tension to go down anytime soon, but they are hopeful that positive changes will be made here at SUNY Plattsburgh. Reporting live in Plattsburgh, Leon Denier, NBC5 News.